Didn't your mother ever tell you not to play with your food? Now, Lord Zazu, you make me lose my life. You'll lose a lot more than that when the king gets through with you. Scar! Impeccable timing, Your Majesty. Sir Robbie and I didn't see you at the presentation of Simba. Oh, that was today. Must have slipped my mind. I feel simply awful. As the king's brother, you should have been first in line. I was first in line until the little hairball was born. That little hairball is my son and your future king. Oh, I shall practice my turrets. Don't turn your back on me, Scar! Oh no, Mufasa. Perhaps you shouldn't turn your back on me. Is that a challenge? Temper, temper. I wouldn't dream of challenging you. Pity. Why not? Well, while I got the lion's share of the brains in the family, I'm afraid when it comes to brute strength, I'm at the shallow end of the gene pool. What am I going to do with him? Well, sire, he'd make a very handsome throw rug. Sazu! And just think, whenever he gets dirty, you can take him out and beat him. <laughs> is our kingdom. Whoa. You see, Simba, a king's time as ruler rises and falls like the sun. One day the sun will set on my time here and will rise with you as a new king. And all this will be mine? Everything. Everything the light touches. What about that shadowy place over there? That's beyond our borders. You must never go there, Simba. But I thought a king can do whatever he wants. Yes, but there's a lot more to being king than getting your way all the time. Dad, what are those birds? They're buzzards. They're scary. Why don't you chase them off? I don't have to. They're doing what they're supposed to do. You see, Simba, everything exists in a delicate balance. As king, you must understand that balance and respect all creatures, from the crawling ant to the leaping antelope. But Dad, don't we eat the antelope? Yes, but when we die, our bodies become the grass and the antelope eat the grass. Everything exists in the great circle of life. Sire! Good morning, Zazu. Sire, there you are. Urgent news. Hyenas in the Pride Lands. Zazu, take Simba home. Oh, Dad, can't I come? No, son. I never get to go anywhere. Oh, young master, one day you will be king. Then you can chase away those slobbery, mangy, stupid poachers from dawn until dusk. Bad back, you know. 
My dad just showed me the whole kingdom, and I'm going to rule it all. Oh, really? He didn't show you what's beyond that rise at the northern border, did he? Well, no. He said I can't go there. And he's absolutely right. Only the bravest of lions go there. Well, I'm brave. What's out there? I'm sorry, Simba. I just can't tell you. Why not? An elephant graveyard is no place for a young prince. An elephant what? Oops. Whoa. Oh dear, I've said too much. Well, I suppose you would have found out sooner or later. You've been so clever and all. Just promise me you'll never visit that dreadful place. No problem, Uncle Scar. There's a good lad. You run along now and have fun. And remember, it's our little secret. <laughs> Lame. No, it's really cool. So, where is this really cool place, Simba? Oh, hi, Mum. It's it's around the water hole. The water hole? What? Oh, I'll show you. Mom. Get there. Oh, uh, Mum, can I go with Simba? Sarabi? Please. Don't write to me. Yay! Oh, Mum, a Zazu goes with you to the water hole. No, not Zazu. Step lively. The sooner we get to the water hole, the sooner we can leave. So where are we really going? An elephant graveyard. Wow! Shh. Sazu. Oh, right. So how are we going to ditch the dodo? Oh, just look. Little seeds of romance blossoming in the savannah. And just think, one day you two will be married. Yo, oh. I can't marry her. She's my friend. Yeah, it'd be too weird. Well, sorry to burst your bubble, but you two turtle doves have no choice. It's a tradition going back generations. When I'm king, that's the first thing to go. Not so long as I'm around. In that case, you're fired. Nice try, but only the king can do that. Well, he is the future king. Yeah, so you have to do what I tell you. Not yet, I don't. And with an attitude like that, I'm afraid you'll be a pretty pathetic king indeed. Not the way I see it. Simba, Nala, where are you hiding? If you don't come out this instant, this isn't funny. I'm not laughing.
we lost him. I am a genius. Hey, genius, it was my idea. Yeah, but I pulled it off. Oh, yeah? <coughs> Pinja, hey, let me up. Pinja again. I know. Isn't it great? We could get in big trouble. I know. That's where I come in. Zazu. This is way beyond the boundaries of the Pride Lands. Very dangerous. Danger? Ha! I walk on the wild side. I laugh in the face of danger. Ha 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 ha! Ah! A simple navigational error, let me assure you. We'll be leaving now. Whoa, wait. I know you. You're the fastest little stooge. I, <coughs> madam. I'm the King's Major Domo. More like King's Major Dumbo. <laughs> <laughs> well, that will make you. The future king. Do you know what we do to kings? You step outside of their kingdom. <coughs> huh, you can't do anything to me. Uh, technically they can. We are on their land. But Zazu, you told me hyenas are nothing but slobbering, mangy, stupid poachers. Slobbering? Mangy? And, and stupid? stupid. Oh my, my, my. Look at the sun. It's time to go. Hey, not so fast, food. How about some takeout? Make mine a cub sandwich. Time to chow down. Head or tail. Yum, 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 yum. Simba. Rawr! <laughs> that was it! Do it again! Rawr! <laughs> Rawr! <laughs> Silence! If you ever go near my son again! Son? Son? If I was your son? Did you know that? Me? No. Did you? No, of course not! Ed! <laughs> you deliberately disobeyed me. Dad, I... I'm sorry. Let's go home. I thought you were very brave. I'm not going to be able to sit for a week. I know. If it weren't those fish lines, we'd be running the joint. <gasps> I don't think you really deserve this. I practically gift wrapped those cubs for you. Well, it wasn't like we were exactly a lone star. Yeah, what were we supposed to do? Kill the Fasa? Precisely. I never thought hyenas essential. Your fruits are not unspeakably plain. But maybe you have a glimmer of potential if allied to my vision and brain. I know that your powers of retention are as wet as a warthog's backside. But think as you are, pay attention. My words are a matter of pride. It's clear from their vacant expression. The lights are not all on us then. But we're talking kings and succession. Even you can't be caught unaware. Let's prepare for the chance of a lifetime. Be prepared for sensational news. A shining new era. Is tiptoeing nearer? Just listen to teacher. I know it's unsorted, but you'll be rewarded. When at last I am given my juice. 
and injustice deliciously spread. Be prepared for the death of the king. No, fool, we're gonna kill him, and Simba too. Great idea! Who needs a king? No king, no king, la la la! Idiots! There will be a king! I will be king! Stick with me, and you'll never go hungry again! Particular planning, tenacity spanning, decades of denial is simply why I'll be king of this music, respected, saluted, and seen for the wonder I am. Yes, our teeth and ambitions are fair. Be prepared. Yes, our teeth and ambitions are fair. in you. I know. I told you not to go there. You and Nala could have been killed. I was just trying to be brave like you. I'm only brave when I have to be. But you're not scared of anything. I was today. You were? Yes, I thought I might lose you. Huh, I guess kings even get scared. But you know what? What? I bet those hyenas were even scareder. That's because nobody messes with your dad. Come here you. <laughs> dad? What? We're pals, right? Right. I'll always be together, right?
Your father has a marvellous surprise for you down in the gorge. What is it? If I told you, it wouldn't be a surprise now, would it? Come on, Uncle Scar. No, no, no. This is just between you and your father. You know, a sort of father-son thing. Now, you wait here and I'll go get him. I'll come with you. No, no. You wouldn't want to get into another mess like you did with those hyenas now, would you? You know about that? Simba, everyone knows about that. Really? Mm-hmm. Bloody Dad was there to save you. So you might want to practice that little roar of yours. Okay. Hey, Uncle Scar, will I like the surprise? Simba, it's to die for. <laughs> little roar, huh? Rawr!
Professor's death is a terrible tragedy. But to lose Simba too, for me, 